Hello everyone, Ron here from RJJ's Reactions and I am putting someone up on the channel that I haven't had on the channel before and it is Donovan and the reason I'm doing it, well there's a couple of reasons but one main reason is that one of the viewers saw an album I had behind me because I have a few albums here and it was the Donovan. It wasn't the one I have now which is this one. This one's Donovan's Greatest Hits and the reason I have this one instead of the other one is it has the song Season of the Witch and that's the song that he suggested I do. Uh, it's an amazing song. I'm obviously familiar with it since I have the album. I haven't listened to it for a long time because most of my albums were in storage for quite a while and I was listening to cassette tapes and CDs and now all the albums in the record player and everything are back out so I do listen occasionally but I haven't uh, listened to this one so it should be good uh, season, season of the Witch we will go over the lyrics afterwards as well so uh, that should be fun I'm not sure whether I've ever dissected the lyrics before I used to read the lyrics um, because they're included often in albums or on the back or on the inside or in the sleeve so uh, probably have read them but whether I th thought deeply about them I'm not sure but we're going to do that today before I jump into the music, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I will put a link to Donovan's channel too, so you can subscribe to him and like videos over there as well. I support the artists that we're reacting to. Uh, also, if you want to support the channel some more, there are a couple of links in the description for Buy Me A Coffee and PayPal donation, and you can use those to bump up your request, get them uh, much sooner in a day or two, sometimes within hours, depending on when I see them, uh, rather than waiting sometimes weeks or longer because the list is long but I am adding so keep sending me information I read all of your messages I respond to as many as I can and let's listen in all right here is uh, this is the original album that the song was on sunshine superman I don't know if I have that album or have that on cassette or CD I'm not sure but I do have the song on the greatest hits so uh, season of the witch let's go <laughs> I like the guitar coming in and the reason I made a bit of a face there is that this is the first time I've ever listened to it on headphones. We used to listen to the albums, you know, just with the speakers and sometimes very poor speakers. I have some good ones that I've had since the 80s, but pre-80s, pre <laughs> uh, some of the record players' speakers were pretty horrible. Uh, so, so it surprised me the way the sound's moving from side to side. Guitar is great. When I look out my window Many sights to see And when I look in my window So many different people to be That it's strange So strange Pick up every stitch. You got to pick up every stitch. You got to pick up every stitch. Mm -hmm. Must be the season of the witch. Must be the season of the witch. Yeah. Must be the going to talk about the lyrics after so I won't get into it now but I, I really love Donovan's voice I'm not even quite sure what it is about it how to describe why I like it sometimes that's difficult to do but I, I really do love his voice and the way he plays with it it's it's great and the music is good too Head looking over his shoulder at me, and he's strange. Sure, is strange. You got to pick up every stitch, you got to pick up every stitch. Yeah, beat makes out to make it.
I like the way it builds up and then come back down again. and then we build up both with the instruments and with his voice. And it, I think at the time it sounded very psychedelic to me. I got Psychedelic Furs album over here and that probably uh, keyed me into that too. But I, just the, the feeling of the music and whatnot sounded very different than a lot of things I'd heard previous to Donovan and some of the others. Um, yeah, okay, let's keep going. Well, I really like that. I knew I loved the song because I'd heard it many times before, but I haven't heard it for a very long time. So it was nice to hear it again and to remind me of Donovan's voice and, and this song in particular. Uh, many of his songs um, I really love. Uh, beyond the voice, the, the instrumentation was great. I, I can't pick out everything uh, because I'm not an expert in that regard, uh, as I have mentioned many, many times. But... Uh, it's there's something about it that that just grabbed onto me at the time especially probably much more than now uh but at the time i think it did and and uh now that i've reheard i could understand most of the lyrics as he sang them through i remember some of the meaning that it had for me at the time as well because i was struggling a lot um and uh whether or not I'm, I'm reading the, the meaning correctly, it doesn't matter because when you listen to music or read a book or a poem or whatever, it has the meaning for you, right? So there is no right or wrong necessarily. Now, you should be able to back it up somehow and, and explain why you feel what you feel. If you can't, then I think that you could almost call that wrong. But uh, for the most part, it it's for you. So once a song is released, once a story is released, once a poem is released, a book, whatever, uh, sometimes the author doesn't have much control over what the reader or listener is going to feel and think about that. So it becomes more personal to you. So let's have a look at the lyrics now. Season of the Witch by Donovan. When I look out my window, many sights to see, and when I look in my window, so many different people to be. That is strange, so strange. Uh, the line, especially when I look in my window. So when I look out my window, 
many sites to see. So, okay, that, that could be literal, right? You look out, there's so many things to see, so many people to see. But when I look in my window, so many different people to be. So to me, that looking into me and yeah, there's so many people in there, and that's why I write stories um, because it helps. It helps to it helps to quiet those voices a little bit. <laughs> uh, you would think it'd be the opposite, but n no. I think you need. Uh, I think something, and a lot of songwriters write lyrics, or po um, poets write poetry, or I, I don't know whether actors. Uh, you know, maybe that's how they release their demons as well. Um, but I think that's what's going on in a sense here. Uh, so many different people to be. That is strange, and it is strange. Uh, and it can be destabilizing. It can it can separate you from the world sometimes. You got to pick up every stitch. Uh, must be the season of the witch. Must be the season of the witch. Yeah, must be the season of the witch. You got to pick up every stitch. I'm not sure, but of course, if you're uh, uh, knitting or whatever, there's stitches and you, pick, you you need to pick up a stitch, right? So I think it's more meaning the, um, again, maybe within your mind, within the way you're thinking, you have to be, you can't let those things get away from you. You can't let that, uh, you can't let the, those voices, those different people, you could be control you. <laughs> I could be way off here, but I'm saying what I remember from the past when I listened to it, but it still makes me think of that now. Um, the idea that this all goes away as you get older is not always true. Uh, and it certainly isn't true with me, but coping becomes better. You know, you, you learn to cope or you don't. And if you don't, you're probably not here with us right now. Uh, so, uh, you know, if you're, if you're my age anyway. <laughs> so, uh, so, yes, when I look over my shoulder, what do you think I see? Some other cat looking over his shoulder at me. And he's strange. Sure is strange. Again, this could be literally, you look over your shoulder, someone's looking at you. So you're looking at them and they're looking at you. You think that person's strange, they might think you're strange. Then again, it could be looking at yourself. You look over your shoulder, you're looking in a mirror, basically. You're looking at you and you're the strange uh, creature, you know, or, or another part of you. You've got to pick up every stitch. Oh no, must be the season of the witch. Uh, not too sure about must be the season of the witch, but um, I, I think a lot of people, well, a lot of people still are interested in all kinds of things, occult and witches and uh, supernatural. And I certainly was in my youth uh, trying to look for answers. I think that's what people do. That's why people go into so many different things to try to find answers. But most of it is our brains making things up. Uh, to try to cover those gaps that we don't have um, full explanations for. But the, the, uh, the issue with, with that is that we're often incorrect and often dangerous, particularly if you try pushing it on other people, which luckily I never did. Uh, but I was looking for answers for myself. Uh, the rabbit's running in the ditch, beatniks out to make it rich. Oh no, must be the season of the witch. Where'd I go? Uh, the rabbit's running in the ditch. Uh, that may be a reference to, uh, it could be a reference to Alice in Wonderland even, but I'm not sure about that one. Um, it could just be the prey uh, or the um, victim in <laughs> the prey idea. Beatniks out to make it rich. Yeah, hippies or beatniks used to think that they weren't out to, to make it rich, but yeah, it could be different ways of interpreting that. Uh, it never was as pure as it was intended to be. Some individuals might have been, but overall, not not quite, uh, I, I don't think. Uh, where'd, where'd I go? When I look out my window, what do you think I see? And when I look in my window, so many different people to be, it's strange, sure is strange. So where'd I go? That's an interesting line. Where did I go? Um, and that's, you know, that can be a problem when there's there's so many different people you can be or voices happening or whatever. And, and of course, at this time, maybe, of course, drugs could have been involved. They were not involved in my life. <laughs> so it that wasn't what was happening. Um, in fact, they did try a little bit of that to calm things down. That did not work. In fact, had the opposite effect. So it didn't work for me. Works for some people. Didn't work for me. Still doesn't. I don't try now. But <laughs> that was a long time ago. 
Uh, you've got to pick up every stitch. The rabbit's running in, running in the ditch. Oh no, must be the season of the witch. Must be the season of the witch. Where'd I go? Where'd I go? Uh, yeah. I'm sure you can take the lyrics in many different directions in many different ways. That's my interpretation that was at the time and uh, pretty much stays the same now. I feel differently now because I'm much older and have more coping mechanisms than I did, but I think it's the same idea. And there's always a risk of losing your balance, right? <laughs> I think I think a lot of people don't recognize that. They may be in more danger than those who do recognize it, to be honest. Uh, you might... You, you might want to be more concerned to someone who doesn't think they have a problem <laughs> than to someone who does. All right, that's probably enough babbling from me, probably far too much. I can hear you saying, please shut up. But anyway, uh, if you liked this Donovan, let me know what else you'd like to hear from Donovan or anyone else. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Go and check out Donovan's channel also. If you like the video, you could give it a thumbs up. That would be great. It all helps the channel. If you want to help a little more, there's Buy Me A Coffee and PayPal donation, and you can use those to bump up your request, as I mentioned before. Uh, I, I know I say it in almost every video, so it might be ad nauseum, but some people only watch certain videos, so they don't see me that often. So there, so there you go. All right. Uh, in the meantime, keep listening, keep having fun. It's Ron from RJJ's Reactions. Bye-bye for now.